proofing today. Um, we are going to be going up and we have a lift that we want to show you. So here is the van right here and we have our boom lift. This is the 350 uh, that we are renting. We got to get up on top right here. And the reason why uh, we rented a boom lift basically was to do the edges here on... Um, on the solar panels and uh, there's a whole bunch of uh, <clears throat> birds that were up on top so we wanted to make sure that um, um, we got this lift because uh, it's too high you know for the ladder uh, so we wanted to carry uh, all this up uh, on a lift itself hey Rick what's up fire in the hole oh you know that man let's, let's, let's go on up so <clears throat> right here we are uh, going up take it all the way up and then swing it there goes the pigeons man they're, they're as soon as we leave they're gone we got our man Torian right here at the edge and he is doing some work um, there and so he's doing work we already got this one all done whoa let me know before you go I'm going. Sheesh. <laughs> so this is the other one. This is just a very small, um, very small. So what we're going to do is we are going to uh, get this out and do the edge, cut, do the edge right here. So that's what we're going to do. So <clears throat> he's going to go ahead and extend it out. There we go. And as we are getting closer, keep going, keep going, Rick. You can only go one way. And go ahead and uh, hit that switch right there. So this switch right here, just so you guys know, this switch right here, you can either uh, go this way, that way, up or down uh, on this switch right here. And then this switch right here extends the boom out. So this is fairly easy. He's gonna do it with his hand control. So, there we go and we're gonna get close here so uh, let's go ahead and bring this down just a hair careful on the way down all right keep going keep going keep going and keep going keep going down because I want to do is I want to show these guys underneath aha uh -huh. and really? as you guys can see it's pretty clean on this one right here so we got lucky we didn't have to do any clean whatsoever underneath but we still want uh want it to be bird proof so what we're going to go ahead and do is we're going to take this uh, a little closer let's go up a little closer rick there we go all right so now we're able to touch this right here able to go ahead and Ding. and and do and do all the bird proofing uh fairly easy so uh we're gonna just basically bird proof here and we're gonna give you a bird's eye um view of us bird proofing torian hey come here you got people waiting on you brother i'd like to give a special shout out for them sunflower seeds man uh oh, let's see who's on today uh Let's see. Sergio, what's up there, Sergio? Sergio, Sergio is a super duper member. Nice. And how about Domingo Israel? Hey guys, have a safe day. Money, money, money. He is also a super duper member. That's right. Oh so sunny. Sup fellas. What's up there? Oh so <laughs> sunny. T L Y N from Las Vegas. Hey now, guys, that's sunny for you. That they are also super duper members. We appreciate you guys uh, super dupering it up. There is the. You see, you chopping it up. There's the owner right there, uh, watching. So, Torian, what he's gonna do basically is he is going to. Uh, let me see. How do I get rid of that? Um, he is going to. Uh-oh. Cancel. What did I do? I did something wrong here. Hold on, guys. 
Okay, there we go. Jeffrey Lewis. Jeffrey Lewis uh, is in the house. George Paulus. Super duper member George Paulus. What's up there? What's up, George? All solar cleaning services. Hello from Orlando, Florida. Orlando in the house. FL Martin Castle, a super duper duper member. A couple of stingers and, and mushroom heads. So, <laughs> Aha. You work on it. This is Chris, uh, Pioneer. What's up there, Pioneer? Uh, this is a uh, Pioneer. Uh, this is Chris. Done four jobs so far. Thanks for your help from Redding, California. So, we're going to basically... Hey, can you turn your music off? Because uh, it's going to be uh, copyright. So, all right. So, what we're going to do here is we are going to um, show you guys how we do this, okay? So, um, Rick, we're going to go ahead and... All right. What we do is we have an 8-inch right here, right? So... Uh, obviously we have uh, this right here uh, this gutter so we want this to hang and what we're gonna go ahead and do is we're gonna hit one side probably be best to hit that side first there Rick and he's gonna square this up okay so this basically show them the nylon clips just so you know okay so these are the nylon clips that we use um, these right here go underneath and he's gonna go ahead and put that underneath so let me get this in there for you guys real good that locks in right underneath the panel itself it's got a little lip right there yep. and then what he's gonna do is he's going to feed this from the top so if you're doing it right here it's one two three four from the top and that should make it nice and even so we're gonna go ahead and uh, put that there Let's show them that before you tie that on, Rick, so they can see. Move your hand out of the way. All right. So you see it right there. He is on the fourth one down. That makes this nice and level. That's exactly what we want. All right. Okay. So you guys can just invoice us? Yeah. Um, I could go ahead and just, um, what I'll do is I'll call you and then we can go ahead and get the uh, Visa or MasterCard over the phone. Okay, that's perfect. And then that little awning right there, right in front of the door, will you guys also call it's, it's all going to be clean. Okay. Yep. Yep. Right, thank no you. worries. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good day. We got the pigeons over there trying to come back. All right. So we're back and, uh, he is going to go ahead. Sorry, we had a customer talking to us. That's what happens when it's live. So he's locking this in right now. So he's going to lock that in right there. And let me see. Take a look. So what we do on the corner. What do we do on the corner, Rick? We uh, take the other wire. We connect it. We bend it over. And we bring it through the mesh here on the fourth one again. And then we pop another mushroom head onto that one. So this, this stinger right here, we're going to leave long. Yeah. We're not going to cut it until the last part. So uh, here, what we're going to do is we're going to continue on. So um, go ahead. He's going to go underneath that again. Let me see if I can get a, a good view for you guys here. Sorry, I'm, I'm holding this up and trying to show you guys at the same time. So, um, all right, he's got that. So he's locked that into place. Be careful, Torian. Right at the edge. Man, that's making me nervous. That concerned me just now. Okay. All right. So, I'm just going to go ahead and pull that. Got it. Locked into place. Bam. All right. So, this, once it's locked into place, it's nice and tight. Birds aren't going to get underneath here. Don't worry about birds trying to get underneath almost impossible for them to do unless they're a worm or something so what we do is we just kind of do three to one panel and that will kind of secure it very very nice and right there on the corner right underneath there's uh well two corners come together so he's going to try to get as far close to the corner as possible and then pull that in Lock it into place. Lock it into place, my man. 
Here this we go. I'm fishing for easy as pie. Easy as pie. There you go. Uh, pow, let me see. Power Slap Entertainment. I think I said that right. Hey, Henry and Rick. My dad and I are trying to start a solar panel cleaning company. He is working. He is worried about if there's any risk of electrical shock when cleaning the panels. Uh, keep up the good work. Uh, these panels right here that I'm touching right here, electrical shock. No, it's DC voltage. DC voltage. These go into a um, uh, a uh, module uh, and underneath and it creates it to dc voltage itself so these do not have ac voltage on them dc voltage are going direct current going through here and uh no we clean these all the time that's what they're designed for that's why they're, they're outside in the rain when the rain hits them well it's the same same concept same thing okay no different all right so good question though Good question, right? Because you can't do this being scared. Nope, not at all. Oh, perfect. Thanks for the answering. No worries. Um, and hopefully this video is coming out. Dude, I think... Let me see here. Okay, got it. Let me see if I can get a, a better angle. Kind of hard when you've got, a, you've got somebody here working right next to you and you're trying to hold this. There you go. Man, easy as pie. That's one All of my right. masterpieces, guys. So, right here, we always leave this a little long at the end because we're going to turn this bad boy. But this right here is going to come out nice and flush. Hey, Rick, let me do this. Let me go ahead and move over to the side because. Yeah, that's. All right, here we go. Let me get this. Oh, would be nice if I turned it. You ready? Yep. You're crowding me. There you go. You hit your corner over there. I'm literally right on the corner. All right, that's what we do. That's how we do it. All right. So let's go ahead and put this back here and let me get you a good spot guys so you guys can see that what he's doing hopefully uh you guys are seeing this okay but he's locking that into place now and there you go locked beautiful beautiful you got what one, can we say man one more here you want me to get this one in the corner it's gotten Oh, you right. got it? You got it? All right, here we go. This is the last one right here in the corner, guys. You can get that as close to the corner as possible so Torreon can hit the rest. And he's going to go the fourth one down. We always go to the fourth one down on this because this we're showing you right here. See this right here? The top of this should be nice and flush with this right here. It makes it clean. Customers like it. We like it. And it's all good. Okay, you can go to the third one. The clips be flush too on the bottom. Right, and the clips are just going to fall right into place, nice and tight. Look at that. There you go. All right, let me grab that cutter. All right, so we see here how it's nice and even. Um, let me go ahead and... <laughs> He's going to start cutting the, the stingers off of those. You need me to move a little closer, Rick? Nope. All right, perfect. So that's all tight, that's all clean, cut, perfect. Torion's up there on top, he's doing the exact same thing. The reason why we went ahead and used eight inches is because we can actually go into a nice angle right here on the edge. So we go into a nice angle here, and here it just falls uh, past this point. What? How did you get water in the gutter? What the? Super Magic. Super. <laughs> you must be a super duper dude. Hey. That's how we do it. Give that, me your words. That's how we do it. All right. Let's see who's on. Okay. Um, 
TLYN says, hey guys, we did our first bird proofing job, the one I wanted to kick myself for uh, in the <laughs> Zoom meeting. Can't wait to tell you about it. Nice. When you come to Las Vegas, we are going to be heading to Las When are we going to Las Vegas, Rick? We'll be there this Friday. Friday. This Friday. There you go. Not that Friday. <laughs> this one. There you go. And are we thinking about work when we're going no. to Vegas? Hell no. no. It's playtime. It's playtime. We appreciate all you guys. Um, B and B Windows. Hey guys, could you show us a video when when you disconnect the panel to get the nest out? Thanks. Uh, you know what? Tell them about that. That just may go down tomorrow. No, tell them we don't. Oh, dis you know, no disconnect. I thought you was talking about remove. Mm -mm. We do no disco. Are, are you talking about disconnecting the electricity? the the power to the panels when you, we remove panels you don't, you don't want to do that no we don't do that anything can happen and if it does it's your fault so don't do that let's show them guys okay i tell you what let's let's go out watch your fingers all right let's go up so i'm gonna go ahead and swing this to the to the right over here all right guys here we go so say you have a bird that is on right underneath this panel there's a bird underneath this panel. Here, hold this, Rick, so so I can talk, and and you can you can watch watch your fingers. Make sure you're not. Boom. Yep. All right. See this right here? This, there's two bolts. One right there, and one right here. You take these two bolts off. You take that bolt off and that bolt off if you want to take this panel out. We don't remove the whole panel. All we simply do. Torian, do me a favor. Give me a small piece of um, of a mesh. Eight inch. And so we have eight inch that we're using for this one right here. Yeah, it can be just much smaller small than that. Piece. Just cut me a very small piece. I just want to show them something. So when we are trapping a pigeon, say the pigeon's right here in this corner, does it want to get out? You know, we got them locked into this corner. So all we're going to do, go ahead and throw that to me time here yeah all right so this right here all we're gonna do is we're gonna cut this to the length of this here and we're gonna basically slide this in here and lock the pigeon in so the pigeon can't go this way or that way or, you know go from from panel to panel we're, and this is how we trap them so we basically just put this in there all the way through okay so we take these bolts off and we can literally just put this right in between two, lock it in. We're going to lift the panel probably about that much just to get them out. So we got to reach in there with our hand to get them, get them out one way or another, they're coming out. And, and we do this, on, do this on this side and we do this right here in the front. So we trap them and they can't go anywhere. And that is an easy way to get rid of uh, pigeons themselves. Here you go, Tony. So, perfect. All right. So uh, that's pretty much it. I mean, that's that's how we um, that's how we do it. That's how we trap them in there so we can get them out. And once they're out, they're out. And um, these panels are pretty bad. They're pretty uh, dirty. But once Torion is uh, finished here and and he's all done with this side, this side, this side, and this side then um, all you need to do is clean wash and clean so um, in this case we have just a little bit of you know pigeon poop here so what we're gonna do is we're going to get the pressure washer and just basically clean this off the best we can okay it's not a lot so we don't have to go into it you know thoroughly but just kind of get all the stuff off to where it's it's falling right here in the in the gutter itself and you know it's not on the customer's uh property or falls down or what have you so uh and then after that uh torion's gonna clean the top panels here but we had to get a boom lift because as you can see uh for a ladder to get up here is pretty tall and pretty dangerous so we just rent a boom lift uh and and kind of go go there you can rent a lift for anywhere in the neighborhood of 350 dollars to 500 dollars a day um 
we charge the customer for it. Um, I think we charge $3.95 for the lift itself, and the customer pays for that, uh, along with the bird proofing uh, itself. So, what do you think, Rick? That sounds quite accurate, Henry. Um, safety first. Uh, there's no way we were getting up on the ladders. No. So, like it, I said, this makes it a lot easier and a much safer. So, you guys, if there's any question about it, go ahead and get a boom. Yes. Trust me. It's a lot easier. No problem, no hands. No problem, no hands. We're, we're here. We're up on top. Um, do Oh, good question. Uh, power shot, power slap entertainment. Sorry, I can barely see it with the sun. But he says, do you require any sort of license or training to operate a boom lift? Oh, that would be a no. There you go absolutely not no it's very simple and and if you guys don't know how to uh use a boom lift or what have you just ask uh like we rent it from sunbelt so just ask sunbelt they'll they'll be more than happy to go over it with you guys so we feel comfortable um you know you want to be actually you want to be really really careful uh especially when you're coming down or or going up on this as a matter of fact you know what we're going to do we're going to go back down so um there's there's three switches here this one is for um basically for the basket itself um to move up or down and then you have this switch right here this switch right here is either going to take you up or down so you move it this way or this way there's a little switch right here that you grab and you hold that in and then you push it up so if i did this i'm going to go up so i hold this up just like this and then it brings it up that simple okay and so we can see um we can see here where you can see torion the zoom in on on torion how high we are let me go ahead and go up just a little higher. Now we are on a two-story building, so yes. they give you a sense of how high we are. So let's go ahead and show them the other one there, the other uh, work that Torion did. Uh, and so that one is kind of complete. As you can see, guys, those birds are officially kicked out. They'll be moving on to the next house, and we will cl follow closely. <laughs> Hot, hot on their heels. What did we say? We say what do we what do we tell the bird? <laughs> Today is what? Eviction, Eviction day. day. There you go. All right, guys. So let's go ahead and um, I'm going to take this. So when you want to uh, on your boom lift itself, it it you're you're going to be swaying back and forth if you're extended all the way out. So the first the first thing you want to do is you want to take this boom lift and take it all the way down. So you see right there, um, you can see where we're at so i'm going to switch this over because this takes it out the outrigger out and the outrigger in so i'm going to flip the switch there it's there for any reason that you guys have problems here's the emergency switch just push it in and that's it that lock stops everything, everything into place. in its place right so well, all i'm going to do grab right here going to grab right here squeeze it in and push forward and this is going to go you're going to start to see this go forward there we go yeah i'm used to this guy so i suggest you hold on while the boom is in motion don't forget to always wear your harness and your safety helmet we right. call it a hard hat and you can see right there it's gonna almost close locks it in we're gonna switch this back yep okay now this is where rick loses his shorts Hey. When I don't tell him what I'm doing, and it's always it's always good to tell your partner, going to the right, going to the left, going down, going up. Uh, you know, just communicate. When you communicate, you know they know. Okay, I got to hold on or what have you. Even though we're here and we're locked in, you know it's still a, a scary thing for a lot of you that don't know how to use the lift. So. I'm gonna to go to the right. So I'm gonna basically say, hey, we're going to the right. So here we go, going to the right. Hold it in. There we go. And then I'm going to line this up down here on the bottom. I'm gonna line that up and... 
Boy, that is nice and smooth. There we go. Locked it in. Okay, now I'm going to go down. So when I want to go down, all I'm going to do is pull it back towards me. That's going down. So here we go. We're going to go down. We're going to hold this and then simply go down. Here we go. And before we go down, I'm going to swing this over to the left. Rick, I want you to show right there. Um, this is the customer's backyard itself. So what we're going to do is we're going to clean all the bird excess, all the bird proof uh, off. We're going to get all that taken care of. So I want you guys just to kind of see. It's not bad right now, but we still got to pressure wash and clean underneath. And the customer was actually pretty happy with you know our service and 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 it being cleaned and all that she was like no you don't have to do it but we're gonna do it anyway now um when Sorry, guys when um when we are also doing the bird proofing itself um we like to sh shoot the windows uh and clean the windows off and we're gonna do that with the pressure washer, kind of clean the screens and then clean that off uh, so it's nice and clean. And, um, you know, it just leaves a good thing for the customer itself. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and swing to, to the right. Here we go. And always make sure that when you are coming down that there's no light pole, there's nothing in your way to where, um, it is going to what happened it's my water are you serious yeah <laughs> needed it i gotta go back up guys we forgot something well we didn't forget we just didn't remember <laughs> all right here we go swinging swinging back to the left yeah back to we the forgot left. something very important yeah And as you can, as you can see, it is right there. All right, coming out, coming out, emergency. All right. Well, we told you guys we'd take you with us, so. All right, here you go, coming down. Coming out, just a little bit more. Got to get that Stater Brother Market drinking water. Not a moment too soon. Look at that. Not even my water. All right, so let's go ahead and... Whoo, that was close, guys. Yeah, see? Water. See ya. Don't want to be ya. Hey, follow, <laughs> follow your thirst, guys. It went down, so we're going down. There we go. All right, I'm gonna hit switch it, lock it into place. All right, now here we're gonna go on the bottom. We're gonna line this up right here on the bottom. Right there, locked it in. Now we are going down. Here we go. Yep. It's just that easy, guys. Look at that. That's it. Touchdown. Easy. Was, wasn't as... scared, not one bit. Yes, you were. You're always scared. So, guys, <laughs> that's where we were. That's where we were. This is where, we are, is where now. we are now. That's it. So this basically is a video on bird proofing, guys, that we were just kind of showing you, um, you know, how we're, uh, how how doing? we're doing. Uh, cleaning and doing some bird proofing. Yes. I'll be up in the back. Huh? I'll be up in the back. Um, Six yeah. months. The so we got a customer or somebody who could be a potential customer is asking some questions. So, hey Rick, take me, take me off here. Oh, bird proofing. Yeah, bird proofing so the pigeons don't get under, uh, underneath and create nests and 
They live in mess and create a mess in them. Yeah, but why would they want to do that? It's out of that now. No, it's cool. Really? Yeah. And, and it, they do that to save themselves uh, from predators, uh, to make sure that uh, there's no predators that get them, and so they stay right in the center. Oh, yeah. And and I most. All gap them. Oh yeah, that's exactly. Falcon and the hawks. Really? Falcon and the hawks. They don't like. Yeah. So. I saw down Yeah. Yeah. Too late. Very. So I, I know they go with the serve with the uh, with the panel, right? What's that? This is free service that go with the. No, no, we uh, charge. We uh, charge. Uh, yeah, we uh, charge. Uh, definitely uh, charge for that. Right. <laughs> yeah, it would be nice if it was free. No. Keep going. Uh, you keep going on that one. <laughs> yeah, but they don't tell you all this when you get you this all. They, they sure don't. All right, guys. Let me, uh, yeah. Okay, I'll have Rick throw it up. So, Torian's asking for a bottle of water. So, get all of his snacks. And get all that taken care of. So, hold on, guys. You have a customer over here. Hold on. Let me throw this up. Hey, Rick. Take care of that. I got I to gotta toss this bad boy. Yeah. You got to dehydrate the man. All right. Okay. Boss. All right. Y'all have a good one. Huh? You too, sir. Thank you. Now, you see, everybody needs water. You ready? Thank you. Yep. You saw that, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> you saw it live. So, any questions? We got answers. That's right. We got answers. So there it is, guys. Boom lift. Don't be scared of it. Embrace it. Make sure you have a safety vest. You can pick these up like at United Rental. Yeah. Uh, for like eighty bucks. Yeah. Uh, they come with. Um, they come with uh, this here. Okay. Your lanyard. Mm-hmm. And uh, your safety vest itself. And make sure you have a hard hat. Um, this is all for OSHA. Cow OSHA, yeah, they want to make sure that you're safe and you are um, operating this safely. That's the whole idea. Yeah, and also so you won't slip and fall and break your um, OSHA. OSHA butt. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. So, like I said, these hard hats, they're not comfortable for us, but we wear them because we know better. Right. So yes. now you know better, just like that. We have to. We have to. All right, guys. So it was a pleasure bringing you guys with us. Like I said, once we hit a thousand, we promised that you go live. You'd come along with us, and here we are. Yep. So, so we rented out. We rented this uh, T350 boom lift. Okay, we bought that from uh, Sunbelt Rentals. Exactly. And uh, so we got to get this, put this on where it's level, and then it goes up, takes it up. And this is just a very small one. So, um, yeah, it's very user friendly when it's level, it'll give you a beep to let you know it's level, right? Then that way you can go up and down and left and right and forward and backwards and whatever you need to do to get yourself there, right? So, uh, you need a truck, which we have. If you don't, no worries, rent one 20 bucks, you can get a truck from U Haul. Oh, sweet, no problem. See that beep? It's talking to us. And we heard it. So, there it is. I told you it was user friendly. So, they don't have a book, Booms for Dummies, but if they did, we'd write it. <laughs> so, thanks there guys for tuning in. Boom Lift 101. Any more questions? Anybody yeah. else uh, have any? In, any questions? We got answers for you. Let me see here. Find out if there's any more questions. Love it, very informative. When are you having the next Zoom meeting? Man, they're already they're already wanting the next Zoom meeting. It's coming soon, guys. Uh, after we come back from Vegas, we're gonna definitely have another Zoom meeting uh, for you members, for you guys out there that are super duper members. 
uh, I, I will put that on um, before we leave uh, on Friday. I will have a date of the next Zoom meeting and get that taken care of for you guys so you guys are all set and ready to go. In the meantime, we'll try to do, try to do some more live broadcasts and get that taken care of. But um, yes, the first Zoom meeting that we had, very successful. Very successful. Yep. Very, very it, thoroughly. There were some great questions, and I think every single question that was asked got answered. That How answer. long was that that Zoom meeting? Oh, at least three hours. At least. At least three hours. Yeah. Sugar boom boom. I'm chasing dragon. This dragon got my hand. Sugar boom boom. I'll rob him people, but I'm an honest man. Sugar boom boom. Calling us right now, guys. So we so, can't help it. Sorry, guys. Uh, we're gonna have to take that out. That's my ringtone. <laughs> so obviously we got people calling us even when we're going live so with that being said we appreciate you guys coming on and uh, we are going to call it a day pretty much we're going to get these all cleaned up ready to go and then try to get out here out of here early just so you guys know this job took us roughly around uh what how long three maybe something like that yeah that and that's getting the boom lift that's going up getting set up and doing the bird proofing about three hours uh which is pretty good you got one guy out there working his butt off right now uh while the other two are on the boom lift and having fun going up and down you know so we give them we give tori on props for that he's a hard worker good guy and uh does a great job Start in the making yeah there you go all right, guys, with that being said, we are out, and you guys have a good one, and we will see you guys on the next video. That close video. to the next weekend. Oh, there we go. Oh. And party? There you go. Peace. Peace. We'll see you guys on the next video. All right. Cool. It just